Uh, we were running out of time in the second video, so I had to end there quickly. But real quick, I wanted to brush up one, one, one more uh, technique you can do. Now that you know how to create one blog uh, capture page, now you can go ahead and create multiple blog pages. You don't have to just keep it as a capture page. You can make it as another page and have links. So you can literally create a multi-page website without ever having to host it, ever have to pay for a hosting account, and ever really learning how to do HTML and HTML uh, coding or JavaScript coding or all that other stuff that you have to go through to make a site. Now, you're limited, of course, to the formattings and how cool you can make it look, but if you're on a budget and you're just trying to get your site out there and you've just begun a business, this is perfect. So what I did on my thing here, um, I created a couple links here, and you can make as many links as you want, every link will be a new page. And so I know that my, one of my URLs is here, and I know another URL. So once you know all your URLs, you can click on between the two. So here, this is the home page. So if I click on home, it's the same page. Now, if I go to my basics page, it goes to what looks like a whole different page. But all this is is, a, is another blog with a different blog URL that's hyperlinked on, on both pages. So it looks like it's the same website, but it's literally two completely separate blogs but it's got the exact replica of the layout, the exact replica of the header and where the tags are at or the hyperlinks are at. So if we can go between two blogs, it flawlessly switches in between them just like a website calling up a different HTML page. So that's kind of cool. And what, what that allows you to do then is you can start customizing, especially if you're gonna go, uh, you know, for example, here's Craigslist. I teach Craigslist a lot. That if you're gonna go and post on Craigslist in a different categories, like for example, if you wanna post to a real estate category, you know, you can keep everything here the same and or maybe change a little bit in here to relate more to realtor, but then change the header, make, make it look like a, a house with a for sale sign or something on it or something that a real estate agent is used to seeing and they'll be more open to your, your opportunity. They won't shut you down right away. You know, they see this guy sitting here and not, I mean, that looks like, oh no, this is a, a, an online business and I'm a realtor and I want that. But even though you know realtors are looking for new things out there. Same thing with engineering or, or you know, if you're an engineer, put something up that relates to an engineer or, or sales or something. Or, so you can always customize this for whatever specific category you're going after. And that's going to help you crank out more sales instead of having a generic ad sale. Uh, an ad, an ad sale, an ad, uh, a sales page. Good Lord. Um, so, but again, I really just wanted to tell you about the different links. So it's pretty cool what you can do from Blogger. Um, so hopefully that'll save you some money when you're getting started off. It's really cool because then you can train your downline too and save them some money and, and it just works out really well that way. So hope you've enjoyed this and uh, hopefully it helps. So we'll see you guys on the net. Until then, take care.